Hi everybody, I'm Jason from As One Guidance, and today I'm going to talk about being in the right place, in the right frame to receive your twin flame and receive all the things that you desire in your heart. And uh, what I don't mean is, you know, being in a specific location uh, or, you know, bumping into or, um, you know, uh, happen happening to run into your twin flame at you know at a physical destination. Uh, what I mean is by creating the place inside of you in order to uh, receive what it is you're asking for. Um, so there are you know two scenarios, and you can you know weigh them out for yourself. And one scenario is. Uh, being in, you know, within in, in such inner peace and unconditional love and uh, just letting things flow in and out of you and, you know, really, um, really being your true self and, you know, harnessing all of your good. And, uh, uh, you know, there's not, there's not like, uh, anything that that really comes up that that gets in your way you know that you can you can uh, really just blow through any anything that might any you know situationally anything that might uh, come up and present a roadblock to you and the other scenario is uh, you know being um, having having a lot of sadness or uh, you know any negative emotion like that you know you you're you feel crazy inside or or you feel like there's an actual civil war taking place inside of you um, you know equipped with you know missiles and and bombs and and all those good things and you're you're up and down and uh, you there's uh, there's just like this wanting and needing so bad for the things that you desire and especially your twin to be in your life and you know you 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 just can't you're just frantic um and to any you know greater or lesser degree that any of these things are occurring inside of you uh you know is is a great gauge for you to understand where you are and how much healing that you actually have to do and how how uh, how it is that you can uh, take on these upsets and blocks and and create that space inside of you to that inner peace you know at, at the more and more that you heal all of these upsets and blocks you can feel inside of you uh, being more and more peaceful and more and more unconditional love and more and more that, you know, things aren't really phasing you as much. And so that's, that's exactly the, that place that you want to strive to be. And in order to receive your twin and, and, uh, you know, magnetize yourself into union, you know, this, this is, this is, uh, the journey Within and then you know at the at the end of that there there absolutely is the prize of, of physical union with your twin and there's also physical union with anything else that you're desiring uh, you know anything tangible that that you really want you know you're also uh, attracting that to you to yourself as well and so uh, basically what what we want to look at is um, where are you? You know, you, you know, be, be very, very honest with yourself and, and understand that this isn't, uh, something that you can just, you know, jump from here all the way over here, uh, in the blink of an eye. You know, there's, there's work that takes place in between, you know, the, those areas that, that you need to get to. There's a lot of healing that takes place. And yes, it could be 
a super, sh you know, a super short amount of distance in between that. But there, but there is healing that takes place. You know, just healing one block and expecting to be uh, all the way into the peace and unconditional love. Um, you know, sometimes that's purely possible, uh, but for the most part, you there are a lot of things that need to be healed within you in order to get to that place. So from what I'm saying is don't get discouraged uh, as you heal more and more. You know, things come up and present themselves that require um, a lot of healing and a lot of love to in order to, you know, completely dissipate and completely absolve. So, you know, focus on what it is that is right in the moment, right in the now that you're being shown to heal and, and take, take that on and then heal it completely and then move on from there, move on to the next one, move on to the next one after that. You know, there's, there's no reason to get discouraged about anything because you're, you're being, you know, this is a journey that you are completely supported and guided upon. And there's no, um, there's no rush. And, you know, just knowing that you this is a guarantee that once you put this, once you put this in motion, you're guaranteed to be in union with your twin. If you take the steps to get there. And if, you know, you can detour along your path and, you know, whatever the case is, you, you, you will uh, maybe delay things. Uh, however, as long as you keep taking those steps and keep moving forward and keep choosing love, you will get there. That's why there's no, there's no rush in doing anything uh, because rushing isn't going to get you what you want. Uh, only doing the work and allowing uh, the divine to provide you with your desire and provide you with your twin, that's how you get there. So, you know, the frustration and uh, the, the I should have it by now attitude is, is definitely something to look at into healing. And it's also, uh, you know, uh, an illusion and a lie that you're telling yourself because you already have these things right now. They are already in your possession uh, at your core. You already have them. They exist within you. All you have to do is realize it. And as you change your internal reality into realizing that you already have these things, it takes, it, it takes a lot of that pressure and provides way more relief to you than when you are you know, really believing in a frantic manner that you're, you think that you're doing everything that you possibly can to, you know, get your twin back and, or get your twin period. And you don't know what else to do. And it's, and you want the next step and you want the next step and you want it right now. And, you know, you're not, you're not sure why this is, why this isn't, uh, going faster or why this isn't, uh, you know, you want it to go as fast as humanly possible. And why is this going as, why is this going slow? You know, look at that from what am I doing to cause this to go slow? Now, if you, if you want to be, uh, amped up and, and off to the races, that is a choice to make, you know, your pace the pace at which you go is your choice. Uh, so look at that from that perspective that you it, you have to understand what it is you're doing to prevent how slow or fast that your pace is going. And uh, taking that and and turning it into uh, you know blaming the universe or blaming God that that you are. Uh, 
you're it's taking longer than than you expected it's like you know it's telling god how to do his job essentially uh and you know nobody on the planet is really at that level or will ever be at that level uh to to say anything about that so uh remember your role in this your role is to love yourself and it's designed at a pace that's perfect for you and god's job is to give you everything that you've ever wanted uh so surrender to that and you know make sure that you are doing your role and letting uh the other powers that be do their role so please check out as one guidance.com uh, for all the services I offer to help you along this journey, uh, I can guide you into union. Um, also, please subscribe to my channel and leave a comment down below. If you have anything that you'd like to say or ask, that would be super duper. All right. See you next time. Take care.